How did this all start? The conversation started when Councilman John Love said that he had a problem with the state racial profiling law when it comes to police departments. It would only be considered a complaint on racial profiling if and only if a citation was issued or an arrest made. Something both Love and police say is part of the state law. The racial profiling law has been attacked since 2001 and uh, we've been making the reports and following the law like all agencies have. Based on the law, the way that it is defined, there is no racial profiling. This information comes from a Midland police presentation showing the racial breakdown of more than 8,000 department stops. According to data arrests in 2014, 91 of the people were African American, 91 were white, and 215 were Hispanic. In 751 driver searches, 26.5% were African Americans, 26.1% were white, and 47% were Hispanic. I'm proud of the department. Like I mentioned in there, we're uh, a professional agency, and um, I'd expect no less than for us to comply with the law. And when it comes to the conversation with Love. You know, he and I have had discussions about race. I appreciate his positive comments. Love says he'd like to see police, city, and community officials take it one step farther. Uh, we might want to look at possible surveys from citizens on how they feel that they are being treated. Because I can tell you that the results will, I think, come back quite alarming. In Midland, Sarah Strackhouse, CBS 7 News.